too bad, I don't reckon. Kinda looks like the kitty cat has a painter for a nose, though. I ain't too bad, though. I, I ain't, I ain't mad at it. I mean, I ain't gonna read the book no way, but, you know, it don't look too bad. I don't know what everybody is fussing. What the f... What the hell? What is that? What? Y'all, it looked like MC Hammer done got Thanos snapped. Ugh, Mr. King, I don't feel so good. <laughs> That's a joke. <laughs> Hello, everybody. E here. Welcome back to another now reading. Uh, I had Earl do the uh, opening, of course, so we could talk about the Stephen King covers real quick. Yeah. Um, so the UK cover looks like hot garbage. <laughs> um, the, uh, the American cover isn't much better, but at least it's not Thanos snapped MC Hammer. Uh, anyway, so into what I am reading uh, currently, I'm reading Dean Koontz's Dark Fall. Um, I'm kind of bored, but I'm still enjoying it. Uh, the reason why I'm bored is because I remember every single note of this book. is one, If it's not the first uh, Dean Koontz book that I read, it's one of the first. So uh, I, I know it note for note, and I know all the twists and turns, so I'm not enjoying it that much. But I still love the book. Um, I know that sounds odd, but it's the truth. It just doesn't hold up on rereading. Um, it's still as good as I remember it, though. Next, I'm str I'm not struggling. I've just, in fact, the first two chapters that I've read of this has have been good. It's just I have other books I'd rather be reading. So uh, the Two Towers by uh, J.R.R. Tolkien, and then we have um, going through uh, Doctor Sleep very very slowly. Um, I told my buddy Max that I was 90 pages in because uh, I'm doing the audiobook. I'm actually only 50. <laughs> I'm actually only 50 pages in, so I lied through my teeth. Um, and last, I am working my way through uh, *The Witching Hour* by Anne Rice. This is a it's a pretty good book. Um, I'm I'm having certain slight issues with it, like the uh, the tone. It feels like a, a gothic novel, and then all of a sudden. Um, she'll mention a, te a television or a telephone, and I'll be like, I'm not reading a gothic novel. I guess it, uh, I guess a gothic isn't a time frame, so I guess it's all right. It's just the tone doesn't vibe with the time frame. That's the best way I can put it. But anyways, what are you reading? Let me know down there in the doobly-doo. But until next time, I have been E, you have been you. This has been another Now Reading. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye!